So far, we have been using the server owner workspace that was automatically created for you when Trellis Park was installed. If my user profile has one active workspace, then when I sign in, I will automatically be taken into that workspace. As a user of the server owner workspace, I can access UX Creator, which enables me to configure and test user experience available on my Trellis Spark database. When I'm ready to start adding business users, it's better if they have their own business workspaces in the Trellis Spark database in which they can maintain their own business data. These business workspaces will not have access to the UX Creator. They will all share the same user experience that's been configured using the UX Creator by server owner users. Business workspaces are created for the server owner workspace by selecting the Managed Workspaces app and clicking the New Workspace Manager button. You now name your new workspace and you need to add a license key. This license key can be found from your portal user and if you go to the Downloads tab, you can see the key here. So let's just copy that and paste it here. So at this point, I'm going to go and click the Create Workspace button. This will create a new workspace in the database and expose a workspace ID and a link where a user can join as a workspace owner. So if I click this link, I can sign in again with my Great Ideas user profile. As I enter the workspace as a workspace owner, you see that my home page is user administration and I can see that I have a user account here and I only have access to the ability to invite new users and see existing users and workspace. So this is typical of what a workspace owner would be able to see. If I go to the workspace tab here, you can see that the workspace name is Tony's Workspace and that the workspace GUID is this GUID here, starting 39CB. And this corresponds with the workspace ID that we created here. Now, if I sign out of this workspace, If I sign in again with this user profile, you can see that I have two workspaces available and I now have to select which workspace I wish to enter.